This is flexibility stretch four. I'm standing on the rebounder, but this one we're going to be laying on the rebounder. So I'm coming down and I'm gonna start with my legs out. Actually, I'm gonna be sitting on the rebounder, I should say. I'm gonna lay back on the rebounder, get a comfortable spot. You don't want your head on the bungees. Okay, now I'm gonna grab my front leg and I'm just gonna hold it up. It's about at a 90 degree angle. I have my toe flexed and I'm just gonna hold that up here like this before I start doing any heavy duty stretching. Okay, I'm gonna bring that leg down. And then I'm gonna come up and I'm gonna stretch forward on that leg. My legs are off, uh, touching the floor. Now I'm gonna come back again, and I'm gonna bring my leg up a little closer. And I'm gonna hold that stretch with my toe pointed. I have my hand on my calves, my hands are on my calf also. Sitting up, so this will work your abs too. And I'm stretching it forward. I'm gonna bring my leg up, my leg up off the floor. And stretch it as though as I did in one of my other videos. Okay. Now I'm gonna come back, lay back down, and have my knees tight up against the rim. Now I'm bringing my front leg up again and I'm coming in a little bit further. I'm gonna hold that. I like to hold it between my calf muscle and my ankle. And this is how, how far I'm stretching down. Bringing that leg down. I'm going to sit up. And I'm going to come forward. And I'm going to stretch right down into that leg. And hold it. I'm holding um, my foot out. And I'm holding onto it with my opposite. Lord. 
down the floor. And I'm going to stretch that forward once again. Try to come down a little bit further. And hold that. Can't quite touch my chin to my knee, and I'm not going to push that. Hold that stretch. Now I have my back hand on the bottom of my foot and I'm pulling it towards me. I'm pulling it towards me. I can, when I'm sitting up like this with my Bring my upper body towards it. I can put my forehead on the missionary. Okay. Now I'm going to sit up. Bring that foot forward. And then stretch again. Sitting up. bring my chin down to my leg. Now I feel really stretched. Now we're going to do the other side. So I'm going to lay back like I did and I'm going to bring my one leg up just at a 90 degree angle. My other foot on the floor, my knees back around the rim and I'm just going to hold that. This is just a start. This is just getting your body warmed up, ready for a deeper stretch. You always want to be warmed up a little bit before you start a full out stretching. Okay, I'm bringing the leg down. I have it on the floor. Sitting up. I'm going to pick the back leg up, have my foot out, and I'm going to stretch and hold on to my foot with my opposite hand. I have the other hand um, on the rim. I'm just leaning forward into it. See, I can't get down there yet. I can't put my chin down. You'll see by the time I'm done with this leg, I will be able to do that. Okay, I put the foot down, lay that down, and I'm gonna bring the leg up. I'll have it a little past 90. And I'm gonna hold at my calf area. I have it past 90 degrees, and you're gonna notice that one leg you're gonna be able to do better than the other. It'll be more flexible. That's why we should work on our flexibility. We should make them even. We're still holding, still holding, still holding. Okay, I'm gonna bring my leg down. Sit up and then bring that foot out. Hold on to the opposite and then bring my 
upper body towards that foot. Now I'm more flexible on my left side when I'm laying on my back. But when I'm sitting up like this, I'm more flexible with my right. I know my body really well when it comes to my flexibility. Now I'm laying back down. I'm going to bring the back leg up and bring it closer. I have it back further now. I can tell this leg's much tighter. And I'm just holding on in my calf area and pulling it towards my upper body. And I'm going to hold that. Sitting up, bringing that back foot back out. Now, I have my hand, opposite hand around my foot, and I'm going to come down and see if I can get closer. See, now I'm right to my knee. I have my chin on my knee. I'm just going to hold that. You can actually lay it on. Now, I'm still holding. Now, I put the foot back on the floor. I'm going to lay down, bring the back foot up, bring it towards my upper body. Now what I'm going to do, I have my hands wrapped around my ankles, I'm going to lift my upper body up toward my leg and hold it. Hold that stretch. I can bring it in so it's pretty close. And then just hold that. It just feels so good. I just love how I feel when I'm stretching. It's something that we should do on a daily basis. I'm still stretching. I'm still pushing the leg forward into my body. Okay, now 
I'm bringing the leg down. I'm going to sit up and we'll do one last stretch with our foot out, sitting up. So I'm holding my foot and I'm going to come down. See, I can come one ways down now. And I feel good, not overly stretched, just right. You can either point your toe or flex it, but you'll notice if you flex it, it really tightens up your calf muscle too. Okay, now I'm just sitting up, um, rebounder, and my hands behind me. I'm just gonna put my chest out and stretch that for a couple seconds. And then we're gonna be done. This is flexibility stretch four.